So this is the place we stay, we have stayed, I guess we're gonna stay four nights, five days, and we're, tomorrow's our last day. I gotta watch, I'll get run over by a motorcycle here. But I'm gonna try to have a little bit of video footage to let you know kind of how, how the place looks, how serene it is, and uh, we've really enjoyed it, so here goes. Sendana Resort and Spa. Well, they welcome you. So when you pull up, you'll know what it looks like. A lot of art right there. Really nice lobby area. They've got rooms here, which I haven't stayed in, but they're all pretty nice rooms. Very, uh, very much many plants and water features throughout. the pool. I mean they've got plants everywhere. It's just a it's just a garden. Here goes my can hear the birds, we hear them all the time. Some kind of bird, I don't know. The big structure, that's where the owner or the boss lives, which I've never met. We're actually, uh, you'll see where the back of the resort is on some rice, a rice field. Let's see, it's got all kind of Hindu art, statues, water features, all kinds of stuff. A place you can set out. Just water feature after water feature, very peaceful. Another group of yeah, so I got interrupted. No big deal. They, the hotel was giving me something. So yeah, uh, yeah, it's got little tables everywhere. Again, water features. I'm gonna call them palm trees. I think that's what they are. Really cloudy today, which I like. Like a thunderstorm. I hear the Philippines is being drenched with rain, so I should like that, except for the high rivers and stuff. In our town, it was, uh, here's another group, another group of buildings. In our town, it was pretty, Iloilo, it was pretty bad as far as the river height goes. Let's see, this resort backs right up to a, a rice field. Well, that's very beautiful, I like it. So yeah. We'll keep moving. I got some people ahead of me, so I'll just video off to the side. Hello. And another group of buildings. Some more people coming. And it's starting to rain, which I'm okay with that. Hi. People out working in the field. Yeah. 
gonna start raining here substantially here in a little bit. All right, and here we are. Just plants growing everywhere. It's just colorful, and it's bali. I mean, they're just everywhere. Plants here. That's one you see quite a bit. And then I like how these little plants just come right out of the walls. I mean, <laughs> one little tiny spot of something and these plants are gonna grow. So this will walk way back and you can see the pool over there. We'll get to it here in a second. I won't get soaking wet if I don't get in. So here's the restaurant. I don't know what they have upstairs. Never been up there. And they do have a spa, which we took advantage of today. Here's their restaurant. They serve some good food. We've been there. Can attest to that. It's just, I just can't get over the plant life here. It's, it's amazing. It, and it, the only thing you hear is a barking dog right now, and that's not usually going on. It is so surreal here, so peaceful and so quiet. You got, looks like statues of three ladies pouring water into the pool. Got a place you can sit. In fact, I'm gonna sit right there later, get my laptop out and do some video editing. But yeah, look how beautiful. And there's the, the spa building back there where you can get a massage or what else, whatever else they do. Look at that, are you kidding me? So beautiful. I like these guys here. They're holding up the, holding up the poles, holding up the beams. Look at the beams, look at the teak. The first thing that struck me, we got here late, come in and got something to eat. Those big, big teak beams. And the ceilings all made out of wood. I'll come here and have a beer after a while. See, they've got a menu. They always have a special, and then beer and french fries. <laughs> hey, doesn't sound too bad. Whoop, sorry. Another side from the pool. Not sure what this is. Looks like a, oh, they have a restroom outside for the restaurant. I didn't know where that was. Just greenery everywhere, coconut trees. Yeah, that's what they are, coconut trees. And just look. Now there's the stairs that lead up to our room on the right side there. But just the garden, you know? It's so peaceful out here, minus the dog. <laughs> I've never heard that dog before. You get to making a video and they've got big goldfish out here. It's an older place, a little bit older, but it is more than adequate. And you know, you can't beat it. I think we paid, I, I can't remember off the top of my head, but it's like between 35 and $50 a night depending on how you book it. I'll try to walk up these steps without falling down, holding the camera. Oh, here comes the rain. There's the back. I gotta get inside. Wooden door. Please do not disturb. But yeah, look, I mean, can't beat it. So pretty. Yeah, it looks like a mirror. I, I know. Almost, I it almost that. looks like a mirror. Thought, Look oh, at our door. Yeah. See, it almost looks like a mirror, but there's no image. I right? was afraid to go in because it's a mirror. But it's not. Oh, 
But this is our door. Oh, wrong side. We may be found our new home. We're going to have one everywhere. And they gave us the drinks, the coffee, tea. And this is the view from our balcony as the rain comes down. Which you know I love if you've watched my channel before. See the restaurant from over here? And the sunrise. <laughs> Pretty cool. Breaking through the clouds there. I don't think this sun or this rain's gonna last very long. So that's a tour of our accommodations here at uh, Sendana Resort and Spa. I looked at my wife, she's over there videoing something. <laughs> I just, sometimes I have trouble with names, especially some of the Indonesian names. It's a lot of syllables, you know, and I don't know, I'm just not used to that, but yeah, it's a, it's a beautiful place. The Indonesian people, Filipinos are great. I mean, some of the best people in the world. These people are, they're, uh, I'd say they're equal. <laughs> it's uh, it's a very religious place as far as the Hindu religion goes here in Bali. And there's Muslim here, um, but everybody gets along. That's the thing. It's like everybody you talk to, it's like they, they say that our cab driver, uh, what's his name, Sananaya. And if you ever come here, ask for Sananaya. He's worked here a lot of years. He's in his 50s, he's a, he's, he works for the hotel, he's a driver, and he knows all the tours, he knows all the places, he's an excellent driver, excellent conversationalist, speaks English well, uh, and may not, maybe just not English, I don't know, but he, he does speak English very well, and very accommodating guy, and just a personal service here, you know, Nobody, we've been here five days, nobody has copped an attitude. It's, it's quite the quite the opposite. I mean, it's just the, the landscape, the greenery, the, the plant life, the uh, Hindu religion is built right into the culture here. And every day people go out and make their offerings right out in front of their houses, out in front of the building, businesses, You'll see flowers on the street as you walk by everywhere you go. And I probably passed four or five just in the resort itself. So they just incorporate their beliefs and their philosophy into their everyday life. And I'm sure there's some that, you know, they don't subscribe to all that, but I haven't met them. And I've just been so impressed. I've just been so impressed with the people of Bali. You know, it's this is a touristy town. It is a Ubud is the name. Ubud, U B U D. I didn't know this. You probably do, but Ubud is the place you go when you are a tourist and you want to visit Bali and you want to see the wood carvings and you want to see all the crafts and the they have nightlife. They have. Anything you want, they've got it here. You know, every place I go, I think, I could live here. You know, my wife's the same way. She's over there. She looks like she's living large, and she? Except she's small. So, anyway. <laughs> Peekaboo, there she is. <laughs> she waved, but I think I pulled the camera away. So, I think I'm going to end the video here. But, come to Bali come to honey what's the name of this place Sendana. i just wanted to make sure because i didn't want to on the video i didn't want to uh mess it up sendana resort and spa 
and there's a lot of places to stay. You'll see it on Airbnb. You'll see not this place necessarily, but you'll see a lot of places on Airbnb. Everything I can tell, I went and looked at another one, uh, another, another place. I'm not going to talk about it. It wasn't very far away from here. We drove by, had, uh, had son and I, our driver drive by and look at it. Even though I lost money, I, I said, no, I'm going back to Sendana because I know I'm going to be treated well. I know it's going to be in a peaceful atmosphere. And the people here are just so accommodating. The lady in the restaurant has been here like, what, 19 years, 17 years? 19. What's your name? Iu? Iu. 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 Yeah, her name's Iu. I have trouble with the names. Uh, you probably won't, but I do. But uh, she's been here like 17 or 19 years. Sananaya, he's been here for a long time. And during the pan pandemic, I mean, it just got so bad here. So come to Bali. It's coming back. The prices are low. Come to Sandana. Meet, uh, meet Sananaya. Meet the people here. And I guarantee you, you'll be happy that you did. So this is Randall with the Philippines Project and Flora. She's, she's videoing the rain. And uh, there's some guys working out in the rice field there. But if you like the content, feel free to subscribe. I'm making this content for me, my family, but and for Flora and I because we like to do it. And we're on our way back to the Philippines. In fact, we fly to the Philippines tomorrow. Um, tomorrow night late, we'll be back early, early Friday in Manila. And then we'll catch a flight to Iloilo about, uh, I think, 11 o'clock we fly. So by noon on Friday, I'll be back home again. So again, it's Randall, the Philippines Project. I'm going to sign off for right now. You guys have... Uh, a great rest of the day, night, wherever you're at, whichever you're doing. We appreciate you watching. Thanks.